Okay, we're going down retro line. Well, not really retro. It was only about a year ago this came out, maybe a couple months ago. The Zartan Deluxe version. So why are we reposting or redoing a new video based on this? You know, I, I was asked, what, you know, what's your favorite G.I. Joe classified that's come out? So I'll be quite honest with you guys. Um, this Zartan Deluxe is a must-have for any G.I. Joe fan. Um, to this date, I do believe this is the best G.I. Joe classified that has come out to date. Uh, there's a nice close-up of him with his eyes. It's an upgrade from version 1. Version 1's Zartan, I found the colors were a little drab, a little bit, you know, not very colorful, not very vibrant. There he is turning blue. There he is turning blue again. That is great homage to the old 80s toy line where that Zartan could turn blue. So, yeah, this is an upgrade from version 1. And to be honest with you, this is such a fun action figure that, you know, I hadn't, you know, played with it or, you know, done a photo shoot with it until yesterday and i'm like you know what you can never really get bored of this figure there's so much you could do with it with the heads and the backpack and the interchangeable you know accessories with the gun the knife and the, the masks and the bow and arrow and the storm shadow effect there it just so much you could do with it honestly this is still to date the best classified um the only thing i would say complaint wise is articulation in the thighs isn't isn't that great to be honest with you? That's of a lot of the classifieds. I think they need to work on that just to add a you know a little bit more articulation. But other than that, that's just being nitpicky. It's a solid figure. See what I mean? There's like in terms of photo shooting and going out and you know going to a forest or just going to something with a backdrop. Zartan works well with that. He just especially if you go to a forest or some kind of warehouse or something you know with an antique vintage look. He's very photographic. That's one thing about this Zartan. You can take him anywhere, whether it's in the fall, winter, seasonal. He, he's just, you You can't get bored of this, to be honest with you. This is a very good action figure to photograph and, you know, well worth every penny of it. So anyway, I do believe this is the best classified. What would be number two? I would probably say Beachhead. I, I do like the Beachhead one. I think that one is awesome. Um, and number three maybe maybe the variant cobra commander because i'm old school that's what i would say i'm looking forward to the recondo coming out next year to be quite honest with you guys so uh the tiger force recondo because i'm a huge recondo fan but anyway um there he is with the skull if you guys want to check out more in-depth analysis of the zartan videos we did we did one back in november of 2021 which details a lot more with the accessories so this is just a brief overview so guys let us know what you guys think and what your number one classified to this date of 2022 is love to hear your feedback take care everyone